Hi, I'm Chris from Theme Park to Table, cooking up theme park recipes here in my kitchen. Today, we are continuing our 12 days of theme park treats. We are on to day number six. We're at Disneyland at the Candy Place doing gingerbread Mickey Rice Krispie treats. I'm sure this can probably be found other places too, but that's where I saw the recipe from. You wanna join me over here by the stove. I actually have this turned on. My butter's in here melting. And now we're gonna add in our marshmallows. This is just a very standard Rice Krispie Treat recipe. This isn't anything special or magical. We're just gonna mix this together. We're gonna wait for our butter to melt, our marshmallows to melt, everybody to get melty and gooey together so we can actually add our Rice Krispies in. And then once we get the Rice Krispies in and we get the treats made, that's when the magic can start happening. That's when I have something a little bit special planned for these guys. So we're just gonna give this a mix. This is probably gonna take five or eight minutes to all come together. So instead of making you sit here and watch me stir marshmallows over heat, I'm gonna get these guys all melted and I will join you back here. Actually, I'm gonna join you over here when we come back so we can add the Rice Krispies and get these mixed in. So I'll see you in probably five day minutes. Welcome back. We have melted marshmallows and butter. We're gonna add in our Rice Krispies. Now, I don't know about where you all are from, but around here, for whatever reason, I had a heck of a time finding Rice Krispies. Like, had to go to five stores to find a box of Rice Krispies, any Rice Krispies. Name, brand, generic, it didn't matter. Everywhere we went, Rice Krispies were gone. I'm not sure if it's just something that's happening up where we live in the country or if it's a nationwide issue, but if you're looking to make Rice Krispie treats, hopefully you'll have quicker luck than I had actually finding them. Okay, these are all pretty well combined. So now we're gonna take this. I've got some parchment paper that I always just hit with a little bit of cooking spray. So that does help keep it from adhering itself as it cools. This is always the fun part, trying to get all the crispies out of the, the marshmallow goo in the pan before it starts hardening on you. Okay, well, I think we're gonna call it there. And then I'm gonna use this to kind of rub this off. And then what I typically do is to pat them down, I hit my hands real quick, a little bit of cooking spray, and then I just go in here and give them their little pat. Now I am gonna leave these guys a little on the thick side because what I'm gonna do with these guys is I'm actually gonna cut these into a Mickey Mouse shape and then we're gonna dip them into some gingerbread candy melts to make them gingerbread shaped, gingerbread flavored Mickey Mouse Red Krispie Treats. So I'm gonna leave these for a few minutes to set up a little bit. I'm gonna get my candy melts the rest of the way melted and I'll meet you back here in just a few minutes. Welcome back. Our Rice Krispie Treats are ready to go. Our gingerbread candy melts are melted and ready to go. We're gonna grab our Mickey cutter and we're just gonna kind of push down through the center of this and hope to kind of get a Mickey shape out of this thing. The next one, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hit this with some cooking spray. Should probably be a lot smarter of me. But that's okay. I think we're gonna get the general idea. General idea achieved. That's very quickly. I'm just gonna do a couple of these right now. So we can get them finished up. So I hit that with a little bit of cooking spray. And then I'm just gonna go right straight through. Yeah, that's definitely the right way to do this. So if you're gonna do this, use cooking spray. And we got a couple. Now we're gonna take this little guy and we're gonna take some gingerbread. It's just very kind of warm and we're just gonna kinda of try to fill in all the little crispy nooks and crannies on him. Get him nice and ginger, gingerbready. that 
one. Kind of looks more like a heart than a Mickey right now. But that's okay. My Rice Krispies might still be a little bit too warm, so I thought they felt cool, but I would recommend making sure that they're really, really cold before you do this, because mine are still a little bit warm and a little bit more bendy than probably is ideal. So what I'll do is I'll do a couple of these to show you, and then I will do the rest once they cool down a little bit more. We're going to give them a couple little tiny marshmallow eyes. And yeah. One second. My hands are very, very sticky. And that's making something that's probably challenging, a lot more challenging than it has to be right now. Okay. And we'll give him a cute little mini M and M smile. He's Mickey Mouse. Why wouldn't he be smiling, right? There we go. We'll give this guy who has a little bit better definition. My marshmallow's kind of weird shaped. <laughs> and then I guess his mouth's going to be a little bit lower because we're not going to try to lift that up. Give this Mickey a little smile. And there you have them. Some little Mickey Mouse gingerbread Rice Krispie treats. I'm going to decorate the rest of these once this cools a little bit more. And if you like this video, hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.